Good Tuesday morning, everybody. Another beautiful one in our city. There you go. I uh, hope you're like having that. a great uh, Tuesday morning. Were you watching Dancing with the Stars last night? I can't believe it's already started because Hinchcliffe is on it. Yeah, James. It did you watch Hinch it last night? Absolutely not. I haven't seen that okay. show in years. Because I watched the first season. It was cute. Because you now, I don't think people, viewers realize exactly what was going on with Ryan Lochte uh, when he was dancing. Of course, he's the disgraced swimmer that uh, embarrassed the U.S. at, uh, at the Rio, Rio Games. Games. Um, uh, but this is what was happening. Watch this behind the scenes. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Some protesters had managed to get into the audience. I smell a rat. Wearing lock t-shirts with his name crossed out. They were subdued. You didn't see any of this on air. All they would say, we had an incident. And there was, it was kind of a bit of a commotion, but really, most people at home may not have realized exactly what was going on. Of course, the protesters were there because they were just, you know, why, they were trying to figure out why ABC had, had kept uh, Lochte's contract and why they allowed him on the air. This is why, for ratings, I feel. I think so. Kev, do you know how tight security is there? Yeah. Do you not find it interesting that they well, just slip past? Okay, I'm not going to go as far as to say they were they were planted. Okay. I'm I will be willing to say though that they had hoped something like this would happen. Because now we're all talking about dancing exactly. with the stars. Exactly. I don't know. I how, don't know how that show is doing. I don't know how it's doing either. I mean, I've I've never I've actually never watched it, but uh, now everybody's talking about it. Adam Wilde, what say you? I think it's pretty sad that anybody takes time out of their day to protest <laughs> Ryan Lochte, like a frat bro who got drunk and then lied yeah. about it. Like, that's yeah. all it is. And, and I know he insulted Brazilians in Brazil, but he apologized as well. Yeah. And you got to let people move past that. <laughs> With everything else going on in the world, you're protesting Ryan Lochte. So I, I would totally put my tinfoil hat on for this one uh, and, and maybe believe that... There I didn't might have been a plan. That reference. What Maybe. does that mean? My tinfoil tin hat. hat. Your yeah. conspiracy theories. You put, because you put a tinfoil hat because you, you You're think that satellites waves. are, are oh, sending satellites. Yeah, I thought it was a Wizard of Oz reference. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, okay, it could be as well. No, no, it's no, the no. yellow brick road. No. Let's go. Let's, you know, there were a number of conspiracy <laughs> theories about the, the Wizard of Oz uh, as well. At, is that at, right? At the time, but we'll, we'll save that so for, many. for another show. But, but this is interesting. And, you know, what he said, a bunch of drunken frat boys doing something stupid. When it gets right down to it, there are far more serious things that happened. They did something really stupid in, in Rio, right. granted. But, I mean, they didn't steal the crown jewels. They didn't, they didn't hurt anybody except somebody's reputation. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I, I, I just think, you know what, he, he's lost his sponsors. He's, he's, he's been admonished uh, and he's been banned, et cetera. I think it's enough is enough. Yeah. And they love to vilify and they love the comeback story. Yeah. So they want to see him sweat it out and get punished before he then rises again, which they will obviously. That's the, uh, the good old American story. But, but, Same thing happens with Justin Bieber. Most people, did you see that roast? I know I'm late to the, to the, to the what do you want to call it? The, the table? The party. But I finally saw the Justin Bieber roast. And I'm thinking, he's so young. And really, is the stuff that they're talking about, did anybody on that panel or anybody in the audience or even people watching at home, I bet you most people, 9 out of 10, have done worse, like Adam Wilde, who just raised his oh, hand. No, no. <laughs> is that not why you're raising your hand? Sorry. No, the uh, first off, the Justin Bieber roast was last year. And second, right. I'm the, here, though. I the, watched it. The idea of a roast is to, uh, to say the absolute worst possible thing you could say about somebody. That's it. It's not truthful. It's just supposed to be like, just diss them as But at the end, he gave this beautiful possible. monologue apologizing for the 25th time, I feel, in the last quite, 12 months quite, for his behavior. Yeah, quite often. And that's the end of a roast, is usually it's like, okay, guys, let's get serious now. And, 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 and that's what happens. Why but, does anybody want to be on a roast? What I they say is so be. brutal. Yeah. It's stuff you never want to hear. It's because not like it's the Dean Martin roast, is it? From, no. from years ago, it's gotten quite bad. Yeah, the dais is awful. Uh, okay, so apparently, this is according to Bonnie, uh, Hinchdown did great last night. He got oh. eight for his first dance. Uh, the judges loved him. Oh, I hope he goes all the way then. See, he is a good, clean Canadian boy doing us proud. And he's gone through so much, too. To think a year ago, he almost lost, just over a year ago, he almost lost his life. Yeah, now so here he is, racing again, dancing. Feels like it's Don't bother watching the show, folks. We're going to show you the highlights the next day. <laughs> Wow, look how serious he looks. Okay, we got a razz. Okay, we got a razz about this when he's in there. No, are you right? kidding me? What's got... there to razz? He's amazing. I know. Smooth like butter. I know, but I can't dance like that. So I... This reminds me of the Lawrence Welk days. Now I'm dating myself, doesn't it? Uh, I don't remember Lawrence Welk having any dancers like this. Oh, sort of. Oh, what a fall, Let's pop some champagne. <laughs> My dad loved that lady, that beautiful brunette singer. What was her name? So proud of him.
Go Hinge. All right, Mayor Hinge Town. Amazing. Doing us proud. Uh, all right, uh, we're going to take a break on breakfast television. We're going to look at those school bus delays coming up next because a lot of you are just fed up. Yeah, and also I'm going to catch you up on that Hasselhoff roast that happened five years ago. <laughs>